Unlocking the Sweet Melody, Understanding, Lullaby. Hello, everyone, welcome back to our English Language Learning Channel. Today, we have a very special topic to talk about. The term, lullaby. Lullabies have been a part of cultures around the world for centuries, and today, we're going to dive deep into what this word means, its origins, and how it's used in everyday language. So, sit back, relax, and let's explore the sweet world of lullabies together. A lullaby is a soothing song or piece of music that is usually sung to young children or babies to help them fall asleep. The word itself has a gentle and calming sound, reflecting the purpose of the lullaby. Lullabies are characterized by their slow tempo, simple melodies, and repetitive patterns, which help create a calming atmosphere and lull the child to sleep. The word, lullaby, comes from the Middle English words, lullin, to lull, and, by, a diminutive or endearing suffix. Essentially, it means, to lull to sleep. Lullabies have been a part of human culture for thousands of years, with the oldest known lullaby dating back to Babylonian times. They have been passed down through generations, evolving and adapting to different cultures and languages. Lullabies hold a special place in many cultures around the world. They are not just a means to help a child fall asleep, but they also carry the cultural traditions, values, and stories of a community. Parents and grandparents sing lullabies to connect with their children, share love, and pass down knowledge. Lullabies often contain lessons, moral stories, or cultural references, making them an important part of a child's early learning and cultural identity. Now that we know what a lullaby is and its significance, let's see how we can use this word in a sentence. Every night before bed, my mother would sing me a lullaby to help me fall asleep. The melody of that song is so soothing. It's like a lullaby for adults. Do you know any good lullabies? I want to sing one to my baby niece. In each of these sentences, lullaby is used to describe a song meant to soothe and calm, highlighting its primary function and emotional impact. And there we have it, a deep dive into the world of lullabies. We've explored its meanings, origins, and cultural significance, and we've seen how it's used in everyday language. I hope this video has been informative and has added a sweet melody to your English learning journey. Thank you for watching, and remember, keep practicing, keep learning, and keep singing those lullabies. Goodbye for now.